Child, they flooded the aisle with water. Amazing. They actually got an incredible wedding designer. Now I'm gonna tell you who it is because when you wanna do this, I need you to call me, not her. So I love Bridesmaids. This is literally one of my favorite movies. This kind of wedding is not for everyone. Wouldn't be the wedding I had for myself, but I'll take your money and I'll plan this one for you. The LED, the fireworks, the screens in the background, over a pool. Like this is where money gets stupid, but stupid good. And then to finish it off, having Rose Byrne's character introduce Wilson Phillips. I've been very fortunate to do some weddings with some incredible artists. If you can do it, do it. If you can get married next door to somebody else that's doing it, you can hear the sound, do that too. I promise I'm not gonna sing, but I want to so badly. To have an artist like that perform, you are probably, oh my God, you're spending anywhere between 15 and 500,000. So one of the markers of a really great luxury wedding, even if you don't have this kind of crazy money, a great tip is a really beautiful bouquet. If you look at her bouquet, you'll see that it's peonies. That is a luxury flower. So just even little touches in your day will make it feel even over the top for your special occasion. When I tell you that Crazy Rich Asians is one of my favorite movies of all time, this was in the middle of movies being about the people they're for. And for my Asian brothers and sisters, to see yourself celebrating love and joy and happiness, it was everything. But this wedding, if we can show you every moment of this, I will freeze this every 30 seconds, it's so good. Classic tux, beautiful, soft, live music. If you can incorporate live music in one spot, make it your ceremony. It will change the mood. Child, the fashions. These people were on point. This is when money meets money. When we look back and look at the gorgeous florals walking all the way down the aisle, it's an incredible infusion of color and beauty. And the best part about it is that these are florals from the area. So it felt natural. It felt like they belonged. It felt like we were stepping into this fantasy of a world that we just had barely a moment to peek at. But it's everything, everything. And as she steps forward in this amazing gown and just takes one gentle step right into the water, absolute pure magic. In fact, if my husband's watching, I wanna do our wedding over. This is what I wanted. Italy was fine, this is what I wanted. But the best part about it is that you can feel the love in the room. And that's what you want your wedding to feel like. Regardless of what you're doing, if it's over the top or if it's in your backyard, what you want is the love. Okay, so this one, technically not over the top, more like crazy creepy, but Adam's family is a classic. But this wedding is how you can go from the sublime to the ridiculous. That's the over the top side of this, where everything is just fantasy and you live in the world of the Adams family. Now, I haven't done it, but I've actually had a friend who has done a wedding in a cemetery. Now, that's pretty cool. I would do that. As long as no one wakes up from like, you know, 1850s slumber, I think we're good. I love that she still chose a white dress, because, I mean, why not? And that they're using literally the top of someone's mausoleum as the wedding altar. Kind of genius, to be honest. He looks like my last groom, slightly gray and ashy, a little scared. For real, that's real. One of the things that always comes through is there's always those moments in over-the-top weddings that leave people breathless. A gasp that they walk away thinking, that was the best experience I've ever had in my life. I challenge you, go find your over-the-top moment. I mean, the amount of money that this couple has spent, I hope they last forever, but if not, I am really good at a second wedding. Without question, this couple in Crazy Rich Asians, they'll be together forever. And as for Adam's family, they're probably dead already, so they're probably gonna stay together forever anyways. Freeze! If you love this episode, and I mean, you loved it. I saw you loved it. Click like and subscribe. Join us on this incredible journey as we take you through some of the best weddings in movies. I'll see you next time. Peace.